So uh, in the previous release, we've introduced a new layer type that allows you to bring BIM data for buildings from Autodesk Revit into the uh, ArcGIS 3D platform. BIM data originates from the building construction process and as such often contains highly detailed geometry both from the exterior and the interior of a building. I would like to show you how you could use such data in a web mapping application. First, you have to convert the Revit data into a building scene layer using ArcGIS Pro, which you can then publish to ArcGIS Online or Enterprise. Let's have a look at such a layer in the scene viewer. This is Turanga, the beautiful new central library of Christchurch. We've added a new dedicated widget that allows you to explore the individual sublayers of this building so that you can analyze its structure. You can also use the new slice tool to peek inside the building. The slice tool removes all the geometry that is to one side of a plane, which you can customize and place in space. So that allows you, for example, to look at the individual floors of this building. Individual sublayers can be excluded from Slice so that you can see them in isolation. The pop-up can help you to retrieve uh, information about each element. And you can also use the measurement tool directly inside the Slice geometry. But what if you wanted to make all of this information available to a general audience in an easy to use and intuitive fashion? We've prototyped a website for how an authority might want to present this uh, building to the public. Let me demonstrate it on an iPad. Um, so this is using the JavaScript API to load the same data set in the browser. The visitor can explore the exterior of the building with simple user interactions, such as these predefined vantage points which the owner would like to highlight. The visitor may be interested in the surroundings of the building, for example, points of interest like the Christchurch Cathedral but also public transportation to figure out how to get to the building. But most importantly, the visitor will want to know what's inside the building. We combine the layer filtering capabilities with stylized edge rendering to automatically generate a floor plan view for each floor of this building. The floors contain points of interest, which are linked to photographs from that location inside the building. And the visitor can also dive in in full 3D to get their bearings. So this is a really cool sample for how BIM data can be brought into our mapping platform to be presented to a general audience. 